What's going on, everybody? Jibba73 back with the Double E Show. It's House Flipper. So when we left off last week, we had finished the third child's bedroom right next door here. And now we're on to Nana's room. Now Nana's going to get herself a nice closet back here. Uh, what I'd first like to do, we're going to hop out of there. We're going to go here. Because when you go to the infinity sign, you actually get more uh, options. So we're going to go to molding. We're going to do floor molding. I'm going to do this. And I'm going to do uh, beige gray. Yeah, beige gray. I'm going to buy many. And I'm going to plop this in. Oops, like so it's going to be um actually what i should probably do first this would make the most sense i'm going to take the yumika beige gray i'm going to buy many i'm going to get these in the corners first in here it's a it's a little tricky um, building these because you gotta know what makes an automatic corner and what doesn't I'll do that there we go okay now if I come back into the two meter board now I can come back down here. There. Whoops, I suppose I wanted to do by many. There. There. And I put that one too high, I see it. So then we got to come in here, and we have to buy many. So we got to fill these gaps. So they come in three sizes: one meter, two meter, and quarter of a meter. Now, I wonder. Okay, so there's that. Now, if I come in here like this. I can't. Okay. So I am going to have to sell this piece for the time being because I'm putting in a closet back here. So I'm going to come here and I want to go furniture. I want to go cupboards. I want to go wardrobes. And so that would be linen closet. Okay. So. That's the wood inside is beach, black afterglow, cherry, white wood, American elm. I might go with white wood and then the cloth cover, flowers, um, red, black and white stripes, navy, pink, dandelions, black lines diamond crosses 
floral shoots. Oh, so let's go diamond crosses, floral shoots. Okay, so now if I bring those in and go, all right, that would be one. Two, right? So now if I take this piece Okay and I take this piece Okay Yeah no you know what? I can't do that. Hold on. Moron. Because then I can't put the wall in. All right, I'm just going to plop it there for a second. Okay, so we've got the molding. Right? Yeah. So, let me go uh, back out here. Molding. Floor molding. Right here. Beige gray. By many. Um, one and two. I'm going to move this out of the way. back in here now this is this is design 101 here this is how this works uh, floor molding Yumika by many so we're gonna come in here like so and I come over here like so Come over here. Wow. Okay. Come on. I had you for a second. There we go. And over here. Like so. Very good. Then we go, uh, no, nope. here we go, no, it's not Creo, it's the Yumika, by many, got that one, that one, there, 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 Boy, that's a goof and a half, isn't it?
do that wrong. Okay, so I have to demo this out. Come in here and from the cabinet, one, two, three, four. Okay, from the cabinets, one, two, three, four. Okay. Whoops, I had it there for a sec. There we go. In closet. Okay, I'm gonna move that over to here. Move that over to here. Because now what I want to do is go to tab here, doors. I want the wardrobe doors. Double gray, pure white, white. Gray, pure white, no, definitely not pure white, white. Buy now. Okay, it's gonna go. Oh, there's a long pause there. It's gonna go. It's gonna line up with that. Okay, so. Come one, two, three. gonna have to go off to one side huh okay well I suppose if I'm gonna have it go off to one side it's gonna go off to this side here so, so we'll go there and we'll put the last piece of wall there and then we will switch to lentils Okay, coming in here, we're going to go back to the molding, and we're going to finish up the molding here real quick, and, and then we will get right back to building out this room. Right? Oh, floor molding. I need to go to floor molding. So, I will be right back. Alright, so I was able to complete the closet. Uh, I even put some uh, uh, molding up top, put in a light. Um, we got some shelving above the wardrobes and uh, got some hooks and a nice little uh, storage unit here carpet in here uh, with its own light switch but it is designated as a closet and it is a big closet for grandma so what I'm looking to do is divide the room up to two sections so uh, I'm gonna have the bed over on this half um, nearer here and then over here, I'd like a little sitting area with a TV and whatnot. And I'd like to use that TV that originally came from the house. Um, now, I've got these light gray shelves. I'm not sure what exactly I want to do with them. I don't know whether or not they would look good. Going across the wall right there. 
Um, not really. Um, I know what I can do with them. I've got a spot. I had to use that for the, uh, for in the closet. I've got a spot out here. I think I actually make a good, uh, yeah. I'm gonna go over here. There. And lastly, come over to this side. And I kind of go uh, here. Right. There. And there. Right. So, how does that look? That actually looks pretty good. I'm thinking I'm going to throw some trophies up on those. Um, not a great color to match everything else, but uh, yeah, I didn't want them to go to waste. Initially, initially I had, uh, yeah, let's uh, take this out. I um, might have to sell it, but I might not. Initially, I was going to place those shelves above these, so uh, above the wardrobes, but I, I decided to use these shelves instead. Right on. Okay, so Grandma's Bedroom. So Grandma's old school. That's why she gets the old uh, molding and uh, floor trim and whatnot. So let's look at some classic furniture for Grandma. We're going to start with a classic bed. So what would Grandma sleep in? Well, she's a single lady. She's retired. She sadly lost the love of her life uh, through the ages. And uh, so she doesn't need a big bed. She just needs a bed that is comfortable. And I'm thinking this sort of has a classic design. Um, now, I don't want to do white wood. We can go beach, uh, American elm, cedar. Ah, the old folks like them, cedar chests and whatnot. We're going to go with cedar and hope that we can find furniture that uh that goes with it now we've got this floral pattern here subtle flowers um but i think actually that looks a little better we've got chain bloom oh that's uh that's quite the red floral shoots no we got rose flowers eh. yeah, i think we'll go with the merry bloom all right so we're gonna buy now and uh Give ourselves as much room as we can. So, because we want to give her a, a nightstand in here. So, this bed is called the Heben. The Heben bed. So, if I come out here to furniture and I go Heben, does anything come up other than the bed? Nothing. Okay, so back here, furniture. We're going to go cupboards. And we're going to go night tables. Uh, we've got the Hermes. Uh, do we have the Hermes and Cedar? We do. So that would be a standard, but they like ones with drawers. Because they like to be able to put uh, things in them. They get bedside table, there's no options there but black and white. Uh, how about you? In Cedar. Uh, buy now. It's quite tall. Quite tall. But I think that'll do. And now let's give her a nice classic lamp. So we'll go standing. Something that's a little old school. Night light. Um, let's go with that floral pattern there. That's just beige. We'll go with the flowers. And the wood, we got a cherry, ash, American elm. Let's do the ash and see how close. Yeah, that's pretty close. Right on. So we will go right there with the lamp. We will turn that on. Nana likes to read before bed. So let's go with accessories and books. And what would Nana read? I think Nana would probably read something about gardening or whatnot. Uh, you know what? European castles. 
Yeah, I think she'd read a book about European castles. She likes her history. So there we have it. Um, now, is that wasted space? No, that's good space. But I am going to move it over. Move it all over just a skosh. Right there. Very good. Okay. Um, one second and I'll be right back. Right on. I had to throw in a couple outlets because, uh, you know, you would have those in a room. All right. So right there. Okay. And there. Okay. So there's the bed. Let's get a nice and narrow dresser in here. Going back to furniture, cupboards, dressers. Wardrobes. That's a four door. I mean, she's got a nice walk in closet, so she doesn't necessarily need a big one. Um, go with dark knobs. Hmm. I have a feeling that that would be a little tight. Okay, so we're not going to go with that one. What am I looking for? With drawers. So this would be lower cabinets. Yes. Yes. Stylish chest of drawers. And cedar. There we go. on the bed. Crouch down a little bit. Make sure that's nice and square to the bed. Yeah, I um, do believe it is, right? Yeah. Okay. So, let's come on here and we will go occasional Halloween old TV because Nana's an old school lady. So there we have that. And actually, because she's an old school lady, she'd probably only watch it in the sitting area, but I'm going to put it there. She's, uh, she's a little modern now. No. No. Go with decorations. We've got plants. We want to have something that's and we have that in the corner. No, you know what? And I have it over here. Right there. Stand up now. I want I want something. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do pictures. So decorations, pictures. We're gonna go down here to the ones that go. I'm gonna buy now. So there. By now. Oops. There. Our favorite gardening spots. Right on. We're going to come over to this side. What kind of photos we have here. Her beloved cat, Kippers. Sadly passed away just a year after Mr. Smith did. Okay, so put that there. And is there anything? Let's go with a vase. 
And we'll go with the little blue one here. And uh, no decoration on it, so we'll go like that there. And I think if I go candle, I go a couple of yellow candles up here next to the there we go I got one of those and a small yellow one over here okay All right there it is so so far we have no overhead lights I haven't painted anything and I've got no artwork so, we're working on the furnishing part. So, I'm going to set up a little sitting area over here, and uh, we'll come right back. Alright, so I went a little hog wild and uh, finished up Grandma's room. So, uh, let's actually turn on the light. So, we got an overhead light, which uh, we don't really need, because she doesn't like it too bright. She has the lamp at her reading nook. She has a uh, lamp by the bed. She has her candles on top of the TV. She's got plenty of artwork that she's collected through the years. Um, we use a wide variety of them. And uh, it's very comfortable for her. We get the wainscoting going around the room. Uh, she's got baseboard molding. She's got crown molding. Um, nice, fancy place. It all looks good. Good. I think that's going to do it for this week's episode. So, when we come back next week, we will certainly um, decorate the yard, put it together for family use, and then we will enter the garden competition and sell the home and move on to the next project, which I've already started in secret. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. So, if you like what you watched, Hit that like and subscribe button down below. Tell your family, tell your friends, a little space heater because Nana gets cold. If you have any suggestions, tips, tricks, anything like that, put them in the comments below. I will read them. And with that, I will catch you next Tuesday for another episode of House Flipper. Peace. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more, check out the playlist above, or watch what YouTube tells you to on the right. Oh yeah, and subscribe.